guys and welcome to a brand new episode of the Five Mexican Guys channel. As always, Alonso, Chris, Moises, and Horacio. So today we get uh, the second part of our uh, last video which is like Mexican candies. Today we got Mexican chips which are a huge uh, part of our uh, snack culture. And some kinds of uh, sweet pastries and treats. And as the candies, all these chips and pastries, you can find them everywhere. These are like mostly Mexican and some others that you will be able to find uh, across the world. Oh, ah, and congratulations this. to the winners of the contest. Ah. So congratulations to the winners and we hope that you enjoy your, your candies and your chips. So guys, we have uh, arranged different uh, categories. So this is potato chips. Like yeah. they, they, these are like corn based, mm -hmm. corn based, mm -hmm. and flour, flour based, based. Mm -hmm. all this, and this is the uh, pastries. Tell us in the comments, do you have this in the plate for you? I think you we might have know. takis. Takis, yeah, they, takis, yeah. takis, takis you you US people have takis. Actually, on our New York video, we saw takis in uh, so oh. 7 Eleven. Oh, really? <laughs> this one's very spicy for people, right? I have seen people on YouTube like eating those takis yeah. and getting really, really hot. Pizza, pizza, pizza flavor, I don't think we you have those. These are. Diablo. 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 Doritos Diablo. Those are very good. Very yes. spicy. Classic nachos. Nachos, you, you, know. you yeah, have those for sure. Nachos, and yeah. these ones are the rancheritos. Much has, better. It's, yeah, it has a very special flavor. <laughs> okay, cheers. Cheers. Tor Tor cheers. 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 <laughs> mm. To the right. Last switch. Last switch. Last Rancheritos are so good. Yeah, they, have like they a are very good. Smoked chili flavor. Uh, exactly. Like, I'm proud of rancheritos. Like, rancheritos yeah. is a pretty good chip. Takis are have are a very, very um, distinct flavor too. They are very acidic. Acid, they, yeah. Yeah, it's it's more it's acidic than spicy. The thing about takis is that like they look, they are wrapped like they a taco. are. The pizzerolas, mm. the pizzerolas are the one, the most cheesiest one of, of them all. Mm -hmm. Because Rancherito, as Alonso said, it has like a smoked chili profile. This one has a more acidic profile. Acidic profile. This also has a spicy acidic profile, and this is just cheese, 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 cheese. Yeah. Well, we didn't try the oh. natural one, but the natural one is the classic. So the pizzerola has a little, a little bit more resemblance to the natural. The most artificial, yeah. yeah. The pizzerola. Pizzerola have been around in Mexico for years and years. For a long, long time. Yeah. I think for from the 70s. Okay, so, so my right. favorite rancheritos. 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 Second also. place, I think takis. Second place for me, these ones. No mm -hmm. takis, me. I think third place, Dorito Diablo. Also. Dorito Diablo for me. Third, third, third takis. Third for me, these ones. As this one. Last place, pizzerola. Yeah. yeah. And well, Nacho, it's a classic. So. Pizza. We think everybody has Doritos in their country, so what are your favorite Doritos? Tell us Those in the, the comments. comments. Yep. Before <laughs> we start, I uh, want to explain this. A very basic, vinegar based, classic. spicy sauce. We use it on everything. But most of all, we use it on chips. And this bottle will last like for two, two nah. months. No. Horacio is my roommate and we can manage to finish one of these in a week. Yeah. We are <laughs> these are chips. This is a Mexican brand from Bimbo. And these are jalapeno flavor. I got classicals. Ruthless. Ruffles, cheese ruffles, ruffles. Cheese ruffles. We think you don't have these. And are amazing, guys. Yeah, yeah. You already know this logo. These ones are Lace. But Lace used to be a Mexican brand. Lace was founded at Sabritas in Mexico and then was bought by Pepsi. These ones are thicker than this. Yeah, that's that's kind of the difference. These ones are thicker. A long time ago, the slogan was that they were artisanal. I got uh, one of my all time favorites, which is like the regular Lace. Adobo. Coated chip, the same thickness, but it has a, an adobo. It's a mix of red chilies. It, it's a mix of red chilies and tomatoes that uh, add up to all the, the spiciness. And finally, the lace, the lemon lace with just potato with lime. We have a lot of options right now. Chips. Mm. I want to so open it like this first, so you can take a look. Chip jalapeno. It has a uh, orange. Flavor, kind of. Flavor? Smells like. Ah, 
That's a weird smell. Mm -hmm. Cheese ruffle. Uh, as you can see, look at that crops. It's super crunchy and super cheesy. Mm -hmm. All the color. So guys, I have a question. Do, do, do kids in your country play with these things? They're called tassels. And you slam one into another and they jump and you, you can win. turn it around. You can win tassels you from other kids. And, but the chip looks basically like this. It's your regular um, lay, but it has the adobo, all the spiciness. This jalapeno one Very good. tastes a lot like garlic, uh, like jalapeno peppers. Well, this mm. one tastes like a really like tomatoes and chilies, basically. And this one, that's the classic. As you can see, it's a thicker cut and it's more salty. Look like a your comparison regular of lay. The, of the lace ah. cut and the chips cut. Well, well, as you can see, these are the classic chips, which is the Mexican brand that Alonso was describing. And these are the Lay's one. As you can see, the chips have, have, have a thicker cut, and these ones are thinner. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's pretty much the current <laughs> So, I didn't get a chance to explain the, the lime Lay's. So, I think there's nothing uh, interesting to say about this. Mm. It's just lime with chips. chips. So I added a little bit of Valentina because it's a perfect com combination with mm. these chips. Mm -hmm. Think of this flavor as very artificial but very good. <laughs> it doesn't taste like real lime, lime. not even yeah. close, but it, it is a very good flavor. But it's very addictive. Mm. If you eat one chip, you will eat the, eat the whole bag. For me, mm. When I have the salt-based chips, I like to mix it with the Valentina. <laughs> I think it expands the flavor of the chips so much. Mm. Mm. <laughs> the cheese rubles are also among my favorites. They are mm. super good. Super good. Chips leave your fingers orange. There's a, there's a lot of cheese. Very, very artificial flavor. These two are my favorites because they are super crunchy. I love crunchy chips. My favorite, I, I'm a really cheese lover. And it's such a shame that you guys doesn't have this on the States or wherever you are watching us because they are amazing. <laughs> my favorites for this round are the Lay's Adobadas. You get all that nice consistency and crunchiness from the Lay's but uh, with the adobo, with the spiciness. I think for me it's a tie between the adobadas and the ruffle cheese. I mm. like them a lot. I love them, the both of them. So these two for me are the best. So we are in the Let's next move to last. Let's move on to the uh, round. Flour, flour chips. 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 These are the flour based chips. So okay. these are oyuki. These are chipotle chili flavor. We also oyuki. have a, a Asian uh, another classic classic yeah the totties it's called totties and the thing about these three we are about to show you is they're that Mexican they, they are Mexican and they are super cheap before starting to film we were discussing the fact that uh, it is really difficult to make it in the in the chips industry like these brands if these brands are on these totties because they have made such a good job they with, they work yeah, so exactly. hard on it they work so they yeah. earn it. Casares. Explain what Casares is. Oh, Casares is basically hot corn chips. Hot, hot corn chips. And it got a kangaroo. <laughs> well, finally, this is the the non-Mexican brand uh, here, but this is a very special flavor. It's, they are the Chetos Colmillos, that they are fangs. Everyone, let's try our, our options. Here's Valentina if you want to put If anybody needs it, I think I will be using Valentina. Uh, yeah, Casares and Valentina. Yeah, maybe we can pour well. Once you put Valentina in totis, you gotta be fast. Yeah, they're they quick. Uh, they, they, they start degrading. <laughs> they start degrading pretty fast. Yeah. So we're missing another Mexican Cheetos. These ones are flavor and um, natural. natural. This is too much, too much. I that color, too much artificial flavor. Yeah, I, I'm not such a fan of these Cheetos. I like them. I like them also. It's I like good. them. 
For me, Totti's with Valentina, number one. Then Casares with Valentina, number two. I think Casares for me, number one. And I will uh, give a mention to Chetos Colmillo. <coughs> That's fantastic. And Totis. Totis is a really good chip also. Casares, Totis, and the Cheetos. And Colmillos, um, no Colmillos. No, Colmillos. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. For me, it's Colmillos and Casares. Her mock category You can walk out here with one bag. Uh, yellow chip. Yellow chips, chips. <laughs> okay. Chips the brand yeah. and chip the potato chip with Valentina. That is my favorite. And cheese ruffles, definitely. I think I maybe I'd go with the rancheritos. Well, I will go out with the, the red lace. Guys, as a bonus for the video, we already got some. Um, Pastries. Pastries. pastries, sweet pastries that you will be able to find all across Mexico. Like this, these ones are really commercial. Bimbo, Bimbo, this brand is the biggest bread baker in the whole world. In the whole world. Yeah. Definitely. In the whole world. Also owns Marinela, which is the, like the the number one market share on pastries. Like Bimbo is a group, right? Mm -hmm. It's called Marinela because her daughter. It's. That's her, that's her name. These are all very similar. This is called the Gancito. Gancito like, means goose, mm -hmm. and as you can see, there's a small goose there. <laughs> small goose. This pastry is covered with chocolate and has cream and uh, strawberry, strawberry yeah. jelly. Then we have the chocotorro, which is very similar, and cotorro means uh, parrot. <laughs> so we have a goose, a parrot, choco parrot. A choco parrot. parrot. Choco and so the only difference <laughs> is pretty much that this is chocolate flavor with. Instead of having uh, the outside being chocolate, it's strawberry flavor. And okay. finally, we have the Dalmata, which is Dalmatian. a Dalmatian, and it's, I think this one is an all-around chocolate. It has white chocolate, uh, chocolate bread, and uh, chocolate, uh, chocolate filling. And some chocolate chips. Chocolate chips. Chocolate chips. Okay, and we froze them. We put them in the freezer for about like two or three hours. Because it makes all better. Just one bite. Okay, let's go, guys. Oh man, Chocotorro all the way. Dalmatia, Dalmatia number one, Chocotorro second, Gancito third. Yeah, mine is exactly as Alonso. First, second, third. Yeah. Tip, Dalmatia, Chocotorro, and Gancito. Guys, yeah, the penguins. 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 Pinguinos. They're like cupcakes, yeah. And they are uh, well known because they have low are soft. And they are chocolate flavor, and inside you got cream filling. Mm. <laughs> and next, what do you got there? I have the. This is called. This is called Nito. And it's supposed to be chocolate on top of this uh, sweet bun. And inside there it's. The, it, it has some too. fillings, I'm right? I'm gonna break it. Ah, uh, yeah. It has chocolate filling too. I'm gonna try it. Mm. Uh, we, have, same, uh, we have some choco choco rollies. Rollies. This is basically like, uh, let, let me show you. <laughs> it's uh, supposed to be filled with pineapple. Yeah, pineapple um, and cream. Uh, <laughs> ah, yeah. This, this, well, um, yeah, this round penguins are the best. Yeah, it's, for me it's oh. penguins, choco rollies and nito. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, totally agree. Uh, uh, penguins. Penguins. Eh? Penguins. So yeah, tell us if you like this video, if you like this uh, new thing we tried, um, showing you our different um, classic mm -hmm. candies and yeah, just treats. basic basic things, treats and stuff. To be completely honest, I have watched a lot of videos where people show these kind of things for, from other countries. Yeah, and I find them really interesting. Maybe really if interesting. you like it, um, Maybe we can try some of your local uh, pastries and yeah, yeah guys, that would be fun. Chips. If you live in other parts of the world and you're willing to maybe send us a, a box, and we will pay for the shipment if you want to send us something. So, yeah, especially nice. if you live in Japan. <laughs> I think that's it. Yeah, for so this video. Thanks, thanks a lot, our patrons. Thanks a lot. Thanks to our patrons, Nate, Nate and Duncan. 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 All our patrons. Hello, patrons. Uh, Don't forget to follow us on Instagram. Subscribe. Hit the like button. It really helps. Comment down below. Uh, don't forget the little bell. And well, guys, we'll see you in the next and one. Eat healthy. Don't do what we did today. No, today no. was like 3,000 <laughs> calories. Or you're going to do have what we did today. <laughs> But I mean, it was very fun. We all feel sick. 
but I got it for you guys. Yay! Thank you. So you can go maybe for quesadillas or maybe for some Amazon <laughs> totis. <laughs> they will be good. <laughs> like an artificial line. Mm -hmm. The texture is crunchiness. Yeah. Mm. It has a very specific crunchiness. Like, what are you? What are you? Doing? <laughs> <laughs> that means a roll. This is a choco roll. <laughs> <laughs>